That was the Charleston. If you want to know how to play it, I'll put up a link to Michael Lynch's tutorial on that song. Fun little song, but the reason why I made this video more than anything is I want to talk to you about the collar red strings. These are on a, a different McAfee Islander. You can see it's it looks really black, but it actually has a lot of red and wood color uh, browns to it. it. Looks like an auburn-haired woman. Um, but the co I put the collars on, thinking they'd look cool, which they do. They sound good. Except for one thing, because two of them are wound, the second and third strings are wound, they're all nylon, but they're wound, they squeak. So if you're just playing, you know, and singing along, no big deal. But if you do walk downs, you get that guitar string squeak. I'm not a guitar player, I play ukulele, and I don't like that squeak. The overall, I'm going to keep them on this uke, uh, probably till they break or or something, uh, because they, I'm too cheap to replace them. They do sound really good other than that squeak. This is what the wrapper looks like. And on the back, it even warns you about the wound strings. Warning, do not trim them, basically, is what it says. And this is why, because the wound string will unravel. And now this is after I wound them on. Don't trim them before you put them on, on the tuning peg. Put them in your tuning peg, get a few wraps of strings around there, and you can just leave them that way if you want to. I don't like all the winding up there, so I trim them. And the way I trimmed them was I used a hot knife off the stove, and I basically heat, heat cut them. That then um, melted that end shut to uh, prevent any winding, unwinding that might happen. Now, if you're wondering what the unwinding might happen, if you were to clip that string before you had tension on it and, and being held in place by your tuning peg locked in, uh, you can see that there's how much unwound from the solid core of the string. So you'd ruin the set of strings if you trim them before you put them on. And if you trim them after you put them on, be very careful. Overall, I like them. Except for the squeak.